Nobody likes waking up in the mornings. You know what makes it that much easier? Coffee, that sweet elixir that gets us up in the morning and in the afternoon and on the go. In the UK, we go through 2.5 billion takeaway coffee cups every year. That means that each year we go through enough coffee cups to reach the moon. And what do we do when we're done? But less than 1% are actually recycled, even when we put them in the normal recycling bin. What? Why? How is that so low? Here is your average coffee cup. We've got a mixture of plastic coating and cardboard. A loving mix that is really difficult and expensive to separate. Like these little guys. That means that there are nearly 7 million coffee cups every single day that have to be burned or go into holes in the ground. So come on Hubbub, what's the solution? What can you and I do to still drink coffee and create less waste? Switching to a reusable cup. It's so simple. Starbucks will give you 25p off your drink if you bring your own cup, as will other retailers, and Cafe Nero will give you two loyalty stamps. So, like me, if you have a coffee every single day at work, you could save yourself £60 a year, which is massive, right? That could buy you 25 more coffees and reduce the amount of coffee cups that end up in the ground. If you don't have space in your pocket for such a cup, don't worry, because we can still give your cups one more shot. Uh, we've been trialling a project in Manchester to come up with an industry-wide solution and for the first time ever, all of the major coffee cup retailers have come together with Hubbub to try and find a solution to the problem. So, rather than trying to separate the plastic coating from the cardboard, we've used the Loving Mix, basically by shredding down the cups and turning them into a resin and then mixing that resin with other recycled plastic, you can create a brand new material and then from that you can create loads of new products. So keep an eye out for our coffee cup collection points, which are at the moment in Manchester. This is a really new approach and we'd love for you to get involved. So ask us any questions as always and subscribe.